Hello guys, Chrome and Wings here, and I'm back with another Ford Racing 3 episode. And there's my mouse, I don't know why, but I can't actually do anything with that. <laughs> so yeah, this is going to... You stay in the corner. <laughs> Alright, uh, so uh, it's time for Ford competition. Last time we did the original races, and we won. Which was kind of surprising, since this is already hard. But yeah, we also... The time before last time, uh, yeah, <laughs> we did the full focus versus GT, and we lost, or well, we finished on on second place, second position, uh, which it was a, a bummer. <laughs> but yeah, let's do the design concepts. Concepts this time, it's also on hard. Uh, this one is actually medium, but yeah, let's try this out. So we, oh god, we have six tracks this time. Wow. Harborside, City Highway, The Railroad, Summit Trails, Mountain Drive and Race Track. Race Track, my favorite one. <laughs> oh, the handling is bad. Um, hmm. I would like to take the yellow one, it just looks awesome. But I take this one, just because of the handling, the good handling and also speed and acceleration isn't that bad. Ooh, take it in yellow. Um, yeah. <coughs> oh, sorry guys. So yeah, design co concepts, difficulty hard. Um, round one, harborside, three laps, standard race. Skip that. Yes! Super start! And oh, oh my god, these cars, they just look fantastic. Fantastic. Um, yikes. And I'm being... Okay, well, the handling is super on this car. Wow. really like the way it handles the curves. The car in front of me looks nice. Eh. Oh. Speaking of handling, uh, but that truck in front of me doesn't look like a car that belongs into this category. But well, bam, out of my face and jump. Who? Eighty-four meters. Wow! Look at this. Oh. This car is doing so well in the curves, I'm happy that I took this one. Oh, nice. Look at that. I'm not, I'm not even, you know, I have my foot on the, the gas pedal the whole time. On the virtual gas pedal. Um, and I can just, oh, look at this. Man, this is awesome. Awesome news, I will always take this car, if that's possible. Why not? Very nice car. Design-wise, I don't know. Um, I think many of the other cars look uh, actually better, but um, the design is, is not bad. Um. <laughs> Alright, yeah, that's going pretty well. And remember, <laughs> we are playing on hard, so yeah. Uh, this is not something you might expect from me, <laughs> because I'm not really a racing game expert, or actually, I'm not really a gamer as such. I won't consider myself a, as a gamer because I don't actually play that much except for Minecraft. And uh, for example, right now, Ford Racing Free, but uh, yeah. Right. Or GTA. My all time favorite game series. Man, I'm looking so much forward to GTA 5. I think I said that already in uh, episode 4 or 5 or something. Um, yeah. It's going to be such a great game, I believe. I hope. Oh! No, oh, that can't be possible. Well, whatever. Second place. Still good. 
uh, when the next one ones I should be alright. Okay. What's this? Mm, racing line. Oh. Speaking of winning the next races, huh? I'm not sure if that's possible with this race type. It's always been very hard for me. Whee! The car in front looks very silly. But not as silly as this pickup van, whatever, truck thing <laughs> in front of me. It doesn't fit into the category, but well. I wonder what car that is. Oh! Oh! Where did that car get the speed from? Alright. Whee! Okay, I'm fifth. Oh, I'm sixth. Wow! What's going on? Blimey. Oh. Right. Hmm. So, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Forgot that I had the car with the badass handling. Um, you. Right, uh, so, something that we could talk about TV shows. I don't know. <laughs> I just thought of a random topic that might be interesting to discuss. So, yeah. What's your favorite TV shows? I'm interested in that. Write that in the comment section below. Um, I'm not sure what my favorite TV show is at the moment, but I really must say that I'm enjoying TV shows overall. In, I don't know, a few years ago I just didn't really watch them. I was more like the movie guy, and uh, I hardly watched uh, TV shows. Um, except for something like the news, but that doesn't count as a TV show. <laughs> but um, yeah, um, since, I don't know, two years maybe, I enjoy doing that, like watching TV shows, and I actually... It all started with, uh, well, originally it started with The Simpsons when I was 12 years old, maybe. And uh, yeah, that was fun. And then a few years back, I started to watch Two and a Half Men, um, which was also fun. I have most of the seasons on DVD. I'm not that, you know, pirating guy. Um, so I actually have all my TV shows um, somewhere in my room as a DVD or Blu-ray and yeah, Two and a Half Men was very cool um, and uh, I mean it, it still is funny I suppose although Ashton Kutcher is just not as good as Charlie Sheen, I'm sorry but I don't hate him or something like many people did um, once he got the job um, yeah, so afterwards I started, what did I watch, oh yeah, I watched a little bit of Supernatural, which is still a fun series, I believe, and yeah, that was interesting, what else, um, How I Met Your Mother, of course, everyone watches that and everyone loves that series, very funny, very well made, uh, I love the jokes, by the way, I watch all these TV series in English. I don't like the German uh, voice over. We always synchronize the movies and TV shows, which is a shame. But yeah, that's just how it is. I suppose and I'm going to the Women's Dance Race. Uh. Right. Uh, so yeah, How Met Your Mother was nice. And now recently I've watched, what did I watch? Uh, Homeland. Um, both of the seasons. Very good series. Um, Mad Men, also kind of cool. Uh, and what was the last? Ah, yeah, Broad Broadchurch. I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with that. It's a British series, very well made. It's sort of uh, the um, 
what's the genre? Um, like detective stories. I'm not. I don't really know the name right now. Um, of the genre, but it's a uh, fantastic, uh, brilliant storyline. And yeah, it's uh, great. I think I didn't forget any of the series. Let me just check. Mm. No, <sighs> that's about it. And sometimes I tune into a series, and I was thinking of starting, for example, uh, 24 or Lost or something like that. But yeah, and I'm not actually sure what my favorite genre is. There are, I always like the, the ones uh, with comedy, comedy very much, but they can get a bit dull if you watch them too often and so on. BAM! <laughs> right, but, uh, that was stupid um, of me. Uh, yeah. So tell me guys, what's your favorite TV show? I would like to hear that and I would like to get some tips. Uh, by the way, if you're asking yourself, is there any German, if, is there any good German TV show that I could watch? And then I can only say, nope, <laughs> there really isn't. Uh, I don't know, Ger German TV is basically, the, the things that are good in German TV is the thing they buy from uh, British or American TV, but they always they always sync them. What else is good? Uh, sports programs tend to be very good uh, most of the time. And uh, what else? Uh, the news. <laughs> but everything else in German TV is well, more like me. <laughs> uh, oh well, actually that's not true. We also have very good detective series. They run. On the, but I don't think that there are English versions available. They always run on a channel we call the RRD. That's the the first German television uh, pr program, whatever. Um, every Sunday they have this very cool um, show, whatever, and they did that since the. 60s maybe? 70s probably? Uh, yeah, 70s I guess. Uh, very well done and they also, they have the money to um, like uh, make it very good. So, yeah. Uh, but, uh, no, there's really not so much else. Uh, also, movies, German movies are not that Great. Well, there's some that are funny and that I enjoyed watching a few years ago when I was younger, but, um, well, you can't actually. <sighs> there are some classic films, for example, The Perfume, but I'm actually not sure. The most, most of the actors are actually American, I guess. And <laughs> uh, yeah, but um, in terms of movies, I have no favorite movies. That that changes sort of. Um, I really like, for example, movies like Inception. That play with um, these crazy ideas. Uh, of different dimensions and so on. For example, The Matrix is also pretty awesome. Um, yeah, like uh, these films. Um, and also Inception is like really well done. Uh, I think that, that was Illumination, wasn't it? Didn't pay attention, yes. Um, so yeah, what's your favorite movie? Um, I'm interested to know if you have any tips, insider tips. Um, Something that is always good is the movie list of the top 100 or 250, I'm not sure. Um, uh, best movies on IMDb, the Internet Movie Database. Um, I've watched nearly everyone, uh, every, everyone, <laughs> every film from that list, uh, from, not the whole list of course, but from the top, let's say, 25 maybe. 
And I must say, most of them are really good. Um, some films, for example, like The Godfather, they're very good, but still, I'm not sure if many people will like it. Because it is from 1972, I think, the first one. And uh, it's just very uh, old. And, I mean, that's not a bad thing. But it is slower than um, films from today. If you take a look at the scenes, for example, um, from films from uh, our time now, they have like uh, cuts, uh, yeah, very short cuts, like it's, it's basically a collection of little clips and so on. And the scenes in The Godfather, for example, are very long. Um, and the film itself is also pretty long, I, I guess. It's actually three films, but yeah. But take a look at that list. I might actually link that in the description down below. Uh, very good films. Uh, yep. Yeah. And you should check that out if you're interested. Um, yeah. In terms of film music, I have this. I think many people like him. Um, his name is Hans Zimmer. Or Hans Zimmer, actually. Uh, he's German, by the way. And uh, he does the soundtrack of many films, for example, Inception, uh, Pirates of the Car Caribbean trilogy, um, no, qu qu Quadrology, um, and what else, for example, The Gladiator is also a very good su soundtrack by him. Um, cool guy, I like his music. Uh, but yeah, apart from that, uh, films that are going to be released soon and that I want to watch <laughs> is definitely The Hangover number part uh, 3. Um, I watched both of the other films. Must say Hangover 2 is a little bit... well it's not so good because it's just basically the same movie as Hangover 1. Which was very good, in my opinion, but they just, it was the same storyline. Um, which is a little bit of a shame, it's still funny, and especially if you haven't seen the first one, it's gonna be very cool, I suppose, for you. Um, yeah, but but number three should be uh, cool. I, I, I'm expecting probably too much of it, but, um, yeah, since... Uh, movies tend to, if there are, uh, if producers decide to make more than one part, they tend to uh, worsen f throughout time. Uh, does this make make sense? But yeah, I, I hope that that isn't the case with The Hangover, and I hope that part three will also be good. Um, Oh yeah, another film, film you should definitely check out is Limitless, or the Batman uh, series. The first one isn't so great, but Batman, The Dark Knight and The Dark Knight Rises is um, pretty cool. Um, I like the director, I can't remember his name at the moment, uh, Chris, Christopher Nolan. Yeah, And I have 28 points, by the way. <laughs> Let's get back to the main topic here, Ford Racing 3. And uh, the FR100 has 24 points, so I should watch out. Okay. Next round. Round 5, Mountain Drive. Racing line. Ugh. <sighs> okay. Got the boost. That's always very important get a good start but I have the feeling that I won't win this particular particular race uh, as well just because I always lost the other ones not completely I, I think I was always fourth if I'm not fully mistaken but uh, it, it seems to be <laughs> I don't know <laughs> 
Uh, it just mm. seems to be as if I can't really do any better than fourth position, which is a shame because I'm actually not that bad at the game. Come on. Mm. Jesus. All right. So yeah, movies, TV shows. Uh, if you have any suggestions, write them in the comment section. I would love to read them. Um, since I'm always looking for new things, and I'm open to all sorts of uh, new stuff, new content. Also. Uh, it doesn't have to be mainstream or something, I always like, uh, or, uh, or <laughs> I also like movies, TV shows that are not exactly the, the ma mainstream, but they are hard to find, and mostly they are not good, if they are not main mainstream, oh no, but yeah, I'm fifth. Oh, yeah. I see you. Um, bam. Take that. All right. Let me recharge. Refill my boost. All right. Where are the other cars? They're like. Oh! You're so freaking. Oh, okay, that was not my fault. Sometimes it's it's a bit laggy. I think my it's, it's because my hard drive is uh, crammed at the moment, and I'm recording. And uh, yeah, I should I should definitely delete some files soon. I think this is going to one be one more of these uh, position four tracks. Um, just frustrating and annoying, and I don't like it at all. But you can't change it. Yeah, fourth position, hmm. two points, and the Mustang Mach match Mach. Ah, <laughs> oh, no idea. Whatever, he is two points ahead of me. Okay, standard race. I should do better. Oh no. Oh well. I got the super handling. So it might be possible. Not a super start. It's funny how all the cars line up on the right hand side. Every time I start a race on this particular track. That's the game AI that is not very clever. Or I'm not very clever to follow the rest of the cars. I'm not sure. But yeah. That's how I roll. <laughs> Alright. Mm. <laughs> I hate this track. Oh, we are all. Uh, <laughs> we are we are already 25 minutes in. That's going to be a very long episode. Up. I'm not sure. Maybe this is the last track. Uh, I have like I'm not doing this for the money or the views or whatever, but I'm having trouble with episodes that are like longer than 30 minutes. 
uh, just because it takes so long to render the files and afterwards I have to always convert the files because they're just so big and the file format isn't supported by my tablet which I use to upload the content because I I have a desktop PC and if I would uh, or if I um, rendered all the episodes on my no did I just say render if I uploaded all my episodes on my um, desktop PC it would just be so loud the whole time the whole time and so I always uh, transfer them to my tablet which is of course very silent haha <laughs> and oh look at the car in front crazy um, Yes. Oh, yeah. So I have to render the files, and this takes so much time. I, by the way, I rendered them in WMV, the Windows Video. Uh, no, the Windows Media Video. Well, whatever. Um, the Windows Video File Format, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. Um, and then I have to convert them to a format which is suitable for my tablet, which is by the way not from Apple. But still, uh, they they can't read the oh, the YouTube uploader can't read the WMV files. Um, so I have to convert them to MP4 first. This always shrinks the file as well, which is nice. And then I have to upload them and. It just takes so much time in general, um, which can be annoying. So I always try to make like uh, not too long episodes. For example, I think the la longest episode I ever made on any game was a PvP event with uh, Fear Pulse, and uh, I think that were about 55 minutes. No, 40, 45 minutes, and that was already pretty long, and took so much time to upload the file. Um, yeah. Are you kidding me? This stupid Mustang will ruin my day. Look at this. Oh, second place. Ah. Oh. But well, I collected a car, the 1928 Model T sedan, sedan and the 1971 GT70 concept, yay. Oh, and also I uh, unlocked this one, size matters. <laughs> what does it? Um, doesn't it, I mean, <laughs> but yeah. So, once again, only second position place I might also try to I don't know do it again off camera but yeah that's it for this episode guys thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next episode